Tinubu is confused, has no solution to Nigerians' problem. Show me says <laughs> this is a PDP person who goes to eh, that is saying Shegu show me say that Tinubu is confused. Is it that he's confused or that he's just being lackadaisical and nonchalant? Is it that he's confused or is it a matter of interest? The truth is that his interest has been to answer Nigerian president and be recorded as Nigerian president, a lifetime ambition that he has lost for a long time. That is just his purpose, and he has achieved it by being registered as Nigerian president. Every other thing go to hell. So he's not really, um, you know, not being confused. It's a mindset that Nigerians, let them, let them go and fend for themselves. I've got in my own ambition. That is it. He is not concerned about the state of the country. He is very selfish and concerned about his person and his lifetime ambition as president. That is the way I see it. But again, let's dive into the details. A chieftain of the People's Democratic Party in Ogun State, Shegun Shoumi, has described President Bola Ahmed Tinubu as a confused leader who has no solution to the problems of the country. Shoumi, a former spokesperson for the Atiku Abubakar campaign organization and national campaign National chairmanship who full of PDP insisted that the all progressive Congress APC led administration is bereft of ideas to move the nation forward. The PDP chieftain spoke on Saturday at the end of the year party, uh, uh, end of year party organized for members of the PDP in Ogun State. Shoumi said the Tinubu administration has no, not only destroyed the economy but also worsened the security in the country. He said the president's confusion is the reason for the hardship Nigerians are currently experiencing. Shoumi said we have entered a situation where one is not just sad, our heads are bowed in thinking because it is clear to everybody that the people in charge of the country now are very confused. They have applied the little they know and it is not working. Life is now really unbearable. The cost of living is too high. Inflation is too high. And people are just generally feeling unhappy. They can't manage the exchange rate. They can't manage the Naira. What can they really manage? <laughs> Obviously nothing. Obviously nothing. They can't manage anything. Every day we hear stories of people getting killed and they have not even... They have not been able to do anything. They have converted themselves into a party of poverty, a party going for condolences and mourning, and a party that is rudderless and directionless. Mm. So he accused the APC of rigging itself into power, lamenting that the judiciary had failed to rescue Nigeria from misrule of the APC. The major way out is that Nigerians must know that the only reason why we are in democracy is so that they can have an opportunity to pick leaders. Now, they cannot be playing with election. There is no reason under the earth for any Nigerian to allow somebody with just 8 million votes to be leading the country when the total amount of valuable votes are 9.93 uh, million. The more they come out to vote, the more their views will be respected, even though we know that this one that they won, they came in through manipulation and an unfortunate deniability for the judiciary to rescue the Nigerian citizens. We are all living witnesses of what is going on, show me said. Oh boy. Hmm. Speaking on his ambition to contest the national chairmanship seat of the PDP, Shoumi insisted that he remained the most qualified and courageous aspirant to rescue the party from impending doom. He said the political party that is 25 years old must reveal itself in such a way that it can reform, it can recalibrate, it can rewrite its laws and rules, it can bring together a set of new opinions that will make it different from all parties, and it can be run in an equitable, fair, just, and all-inclusive manner. Most of our PDP members are not saying that they want just a chairman. They are saying that they want Otumba Shogun Shoumi as their chairman. I will try my best, and if it is the wish of the leaders and the colleagues, certainly they can get ready for a remarkable and 
quite incisive uh, tenor a paradigm shift and a new mayor <laughs> every other zone has done chairman apart from us that is even beyond that now it is about who has passion who has courage who has tenacity who has competence okay who has capabilities who has knowledge and how to administer party and by the grace of god we will do what uh, we will do what we can if we get there <laughs> show me want to be the chairman of uh, pdp pdp is finished actually so but the thing here is saying that the Tinubu government, including Tinubu himself, they are confused. They don't know what to do. They have tried the little they know and it's not working. And right now they don't know what to do anymore. They are very, very confused. And in addition to that, he wants to be chairman of PDP so that he can move the party from where it is to the next level where it's supposed to be. Okay. And uh, people are reacting to this Shegun Show with me a statement. So I said, Tinubu's Agbiru's governor always talk and talking no solutions empty barrels <laughs> uh so he said only six months in power he has taken steps many couldn't for survival of next generation people like you stealing and wanting to eat the future will continue to fail i will endure temporary pain for my children to have a better nigeria who oh, you are finished too this person is talking like this are you sure there will be a better nigeria look at the trend of nigeria from independence to today it keeps going down how much more is it going to go down we don't know how far more is it going down we don't know we are talking of future <laughs> okay now be patient a patient dog does not see any bone to eat in this kind of era that is it as long as how many times borrow borrow in few months not be smart you know as a magician Tinubu supposed to solve Nigeria's problem within six months. I will recommend you go for head resetting. Can you imagine? It's crude oil here, no longer flowing. <laughs> they hear daft. Can you imagine? After six months in office, you are a jester, I guess. If you are not, then you little to nothing about governance. You know little to nothing about governance. You can't explain economic restructuring, vis-a-vis -vis policy, trust of the government. It is a pity. People come to the air, okay, vent their hate and sentimental tendencies. So what are you saying? And a simple truth anyway. Okay. Uh, whatever anyone has to say about this government, I don't think Nigeria will be a better country after this current regime, even though I am not a prophet of doom. <laughs> You are not only a prophet of doom, but also a Lucifer incarnate. Okay, well, that is what you think. But I think what if you look at the trend of Nigeria, I tell you it's going to be difficult for Nigeria to get better. Hmm. It's going to be difficult for Nigeria to get better. I must tell you the truth. Very difficult. I thought say, be all shame to you. APC created uh, SSL, the problem okay hater of truth of course of course he has fired the, the man that is calling show me not an angel in all of his case how can you say show me not an angel it's not about being an angel it's about saying things and seeing it and saying it the way they are that is it we must change what are apc leaders doing okay <laughs> they should respond to this show me submission if they are serious let us see uh if he can become pdp's chairman after destroying pdp in Ugu state with his divisive politics so that is what shegu show me saying that Tinubu's government is confused they don't know what to do and they don't know what else to go i mean what else to do again <laughs>